concerning the tithe of the herd. I'm going to explain that. so that it could support the temple, the tabernacle, the preacher, priests, the Levites. That's the way they were paid. That's why churches have an offering all the time. They use that money to pay the preacher, pay the bills, that they would earn the same bank, one tenth they give to the temple. That's the ATAG. God said we needed that so that the priests and the workers in the church could have money to live with.
small for babies. Those are the only ones that were born that year. They would count them. supported the priests, the preachers, supported the Levites. That's the same as deacon deacons. Deacons today. They worked in the church, fixed things, helped the priests do their work. So it supported them so that they could live and work for God. It's not talking about the little children or kids, but the people, the, the Jewish people. In the Bible, many, many times you'll see the C H I L D of Israel. That means the adults and children, all the people. They brought in much. that you harvest first. You know, you, you have a garden. You know that if you plant beans, beans, and you want to grow, when it's time to gather them in,
So increase nine. You give God one tenth of nine beans. Okay. That's what that means. You have two sheep. your increase. Well, right. You begin with two. Two. Oh, no, no, no. I'm not thinking. Eighteen. Eighteen. Eight. 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 You begin with two. Stop. You're confusing me. <laughs> you said that ten. She's ten. right. Ten. I'm wrong. <laughs> She's right. You have two when you start. Now you have ten. So you have an increase. An increase of eight. You give you give God one ten. My But all the people that work in the temple required to do the same thing. They're supported with the time. So they support the boss priest or the high priest, the one that rules, rules. He's the boss. In my church, that's me. Yeah. Oh. That's right. That's what they did. They didn't burn it. But the priests and the men. the way he offered it to God. And that became his. That was his pay. And he came back. And he carried it home. And he could sell it, use it, eat it. It didn't matter. It was his. It's the same way that a church pays the preacher. But we do not have an offering. You pay them with money. But that's the way they did it in the Old Testament. Okay. So now, we do it different. told the church on the first day in the week what day is that? First day. Sunday. 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 Many people think that Sunday is the last day but that's wrong. It's the first day. That everyone collect Saying the same thing. Collect 
the same as God has prospered you. It means the same. things that we do in the church so that we can meet here. This is one of the things. Uh, BBS is for the children to come in the, in, the, in the summertime for teaching them the Bible. Revivals. You pay the preachers that come and preach. You pay all expenses to support the missionaries or the missionaries that travel to other countries so that they can help start other churches to help poor people and to help in times when there's a need emergencies Now, some preachers will argue with me about that, but I want them to show me in the Bible, and they can't. Okay? James chapter 1, verse 5. If any of you without wisdom, let him ask God, who gives it, uh, who gives freely. He doesn't scold you for asking him about wisdom. God does not scold you when you ask him to help you understand. Ask God for wisdom. God's happy to give it. Free. So, it means to scold. says, I want you to do it free. 
No one forces you. You do it because you want to do it. It means if you have a free desire in your heart, God will accept your offering. But if not, God says, doesn't want God wants us to give as much as we can not what we don't have but what we can many churches try to make people feel guilty and that's wrong need to give to God because He touch, touches our heart and blesses us. And that's the way we say, thank you, Lord. We support your work. Now, I say, he who soweth a little bit will gather a little bit. But who gives a lot will gather a lot. It's the same idea that if you have a garden. Corn, corn, okay. We'll use that. Corn, okay. Corn, different. Corn, we're smart. <laughs> <laughs> we agree. <laughs> okay. You want um, <laughs> corn? That's the way we decide. The more you, the more you give God, the more God will bless you. Give God a little, God will bless you a little. church and give a lot. God blesses them all the time. Give them more, more, more. I know one man in debt, but he continued to give to God. Come on, about a year, the debt smaller, smaller, smaller. Blessing gave him a lot of work to make things work for him. God blesses many, many different ways. Give free. That's what it means to give to you. 
want to talk about this, and we'll do that again later, or later, later, when, when we have more people here. But we talked about starting a deaf church. And to do that required that we support it. good that they allow us to be here, but this is their, their building, not ours. So, we need to pray much about that. But we will not start until we're ready. We're not going to force anyone to start early. It's not good. We'll know what it's time. God will burden everyone in the group. Okay. Questions? Oh, you're smart. Mm -hmm.